Hello, hello. Welcome to the Deborah Berry channel. If this is your first time, I am Deborah Berry. This channel is about fashion and styling and doing everything we can, ladies, to hold on to our pretty. It is about getting dressed and looking our very best. We want to get up, get dressed, and look our very best at all times. Whatever it takes, ladies. That's what we want to do, right? And welcome, welcome back to my returning subscribers. I love you. I thank you. I appreciate you. All right, ladies, let's get this one started. It's a new week. Oh, the last part of April. Getting ready to go into May. Yay, yay for May. So let's do uh, on my nails. One of my favorites is uh, uh, Olive and June. KMC is the color name. What is that? oceanic looking island or blue I don't know it makes me think of the ocean for some reason I don't know but tropical it's a nice greenish color I love it and I have I just have on the regular top coat you know last week I did the uh, the matte top coat and it didn't last as long it seemed like every crack in my polish just it just so I went back to the shiny but I'm going to try the matte again and I think what I'm going to do with the matte is put the the high gloss on and then put it on top of that to see how how that holds up but it was you know it was fun to do uh, on my lips I showed you last week also this Bobbi Brown coral color I don't know if I like it or not it's a nice color it's an orangey red but it doesn't feel like the um, Carolina Herrera it doesn't feel like the Prada matte it doesn't feel like Pat McGrath's matte and I don't know, I like the way those dry down powdery feeling, even the Tilbury ones. Just, this one is still kind of creamy, and I'll show it to you again. It's a Power Play 528, but I don't know, it's, I, maybe her matte isn't, it's a luxe matte, so maybe that's got something to do with it. But again, good color, good, good color. I don't know. I'm still on the fence about it. I'll see how it, it does. And the others, you know, they don't transfer as much. I don't know if this is going to transfer or not. I guess I, I haven't tried it. But if you want to give it a try, give it a try. But we'll see. I'm still on. I probably wouldn't buy another Bobbi Brown matte. I'd stick with it because I'm going to get that Prada. I want to get the, I got the Prada in the pink, didn't I? I want to get the Prada in the red. And if they have an orange. So. Just, just a little, little update on that. Now, let me give you another update. And I have to make a confession, ladies. I drank the Kool-Aid. Yes, I did. I drank the Kool-Aid. So, remember last week I showed you this Tom Ford little sampler set of all of the fragrances. Four of the fragrances, not all of his fragrances. Love, love, love. Every time I walk by, I just could smell it. But, one of these really sent me over the edge and that would be this one right here this rose prick I mean it had me in a chokehold it was just like you gotta get this you gotta get this so I drank the Kool-Aid I bit the bullet and bada bing I ordered her from Saks would you tell me let me tell you. she was $3.95 I know I'm crazy crazy as as my aunt would say but Sometimes you just have to do crazy stuff, right? I had a little sex gift card that took something off, but this is the uh, 50 milligram bottle for $3.95. You know, Tom has lost his mind, right? But man, it smells so, so good. And with it, you got this was your little free gift, which is just, you know, a little, just like I just showed you. But it's a small one, I guess, if you want to take it with you, which is kind of nice. And you know I love miniatures. So you do get that. And how much is in there? Four milligrams or some kind of milligrams. Four milligrams. <laughs> wow. I don't know. I just it smells so good. Just And after I take a bath at night, I like to take the little one and just dab it. And through the night, I turn over and I smell it. And... Mm, so yes, ladies, if you want to treat yourself, Mother's Day, how wonderful a mother are you? Three ninety-five at at Saks. I'm sure they may have them other. I went to the site and didn't even list this on the uh, Tom Ford site. They had the, the newer ones, 
which, oh my God, but if you want to treat yourself and try something fresh and wonderful, you know, I would say do this first for a hundred bucks. Do this first and decide, because I was watching Tashara uh, last night on, on YouTube and her, she was, she has a bottle of this, a big bottle of this one, and she mixes it with a, another cologne she has. and. She loves it, you know, and I kept thinking, she just pulled that bottle out like it was, it wasn't a $395 bottle of cologne. She just pulled it. I said, I guess those high-end influencers can buy the, you know, the cologne, $300 doesn't, like, turn their heads. I was still getting over the Carolina Herrera, the Carolina Herrera fragrances and getting them for $195 and $130 and all that, but... Me and Tom, and she's pink. You know I love pink, ladies. <laughs> ah, okay, got that out of the way. I hope you had a great week. Ah, yes, the weather's better. Oh, and we just, here on the home front, we got new front door, we got new patio doors, and we got a new door to the side entry of the garage. And we went with Anderson Renewal windows. Oh my God, they were fantastic. It was two days here, Thursday and Friday the best three guys you could ever want to work on your house and the top-notch work and the door looks so beautiful and then you know we got ADT to put in a little kind of like the um, ring light but it's their uh, nest home or something so we got all of that so I'm really feeling it so now we got to do some more work it's always something with a house right ladies I know it is there's so much we need done but I'm really thankful and thank you God I'm so blessed that we got that done so let's just moving right along let's update on the on the Barry household all right this week's topic yay 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 I have been on uh, from uh, at Talbot's I'm talking about Talbot's this is all about I got four blazers from Talbot's you know I bought four blazers last year from Talbot's they make a good classic blazer that's at a price range. Usually I'll get the 40% off or 30% off or buy one, get one half off. I'm always trying to get them on sale, which is also a good deal. So I got, I got four and I tried to get some color, ladies. Remember I told you I was trying to add some color? So I got two in colors, you know. I got a navy one, I got some orange color, and I got a lavender color, purpley color. And I got a denim one. That I want, I'm going to do that one first because I, it's not linen, which the others are linen, but I want to show you this denim blazer because it's fantastic. And there are some pants that go to it, but none of Talbot's pants are long enough for me. You know, a lot of people might say, why don't you show a cheaper, cheaper price range? A lot of the times the cheaper price range, just the pants aren't long enough, the, the clothes aren't cut for me. You have to find what works for your body your body type, your body style, and your lifestyle, and your budget, your pocket, you know. And I understand that getting, and some people can go get those, you know, I, I don't, I can get tops from those places. I can buy a top anywhere. But when it comes to skirts and slacks, dresses, they're not going to be long enough. They're not going to be cut right. And you just have to find what works for you. That's the important thing. So anyway, back to the title, the uh, topic. I got the blazers and I want to share them with you. They're classic blazers. They're blazers you can create styles with going into summer and taking you into early fall. And I, I have four from last year. I have a white blazer. I have a, a powder blue color blazer. I have a pink blazer and I got a yellow blazer. Yeah, I think I did get a yellow blazer from Talbot's last year. I got four. So this year I got four more. And if they keep making nice blazers, because some of the other places, the places are so expensive. And I think these ran one something. I can't remember the original price, but I got them all with 40% off or something off. Or, you know, I accumulate those Talbot's dollars or whatever, and they'll send me that to get $30 off or $20 off. So I am going to uh, show you the first look. It's going to be very casual. Thus, the little button down. Just keep it simple. Keep it classic. It's four looks, four blazers. And you will see them again through the rest of the summer styling because I don't want to show you a one time I wore this. I like to style and restyle the pieces so that if you got it, 
it's there's just not one way to wear it. I hope I'm making myself clear on that. I want to make it clear. I just want want to make it where we can create our looks and take one piece and create three or four looks. So we're gonna uh, do that today. And don't forget, get you some Tom Ford. <laughs> As for for Mother's Day, if you're if you got about four kids, they can each put in a hundred dollars and get you this. That's a good gift, right? <laughs> Uh, especially if you got four kids oh my goodness so for like young adult kids I don't mean the babies or a really sweet husband or a sweetheart <laughs> I'll be right back with the first look look number one ladies it's a just a classic denim blazer has stretch in it and I have it dressed up just really dressed it down very, very casual but I want you to look at it look at the detail on the lapel, the stitching, it has a beautiful gold button, the pockets with the stitching around the outside, look at the buttons on the cuff, beautiful buttons on the cuff, there's a seam in the back stitched, look at that, that is, it's just a detail, it's one of those dressy denim blazers, you could dress up or dress down, and they have pants that go with it, but of course they don't fit me, but I think you should check them out, the pants are really cool, they go with with this blazer and I put it on with my Michael Kors denim bag look at that match look at that match amazing and I bought this last last summer or something like that I was walking through Dillard's and it was on sale and it's just been sitting there I have yet to do anything with it but I mean this jacket is the perfect jacket with with this with this bag and you can make it crossbody or just double the straps I have it in a dark green I've probably shown you that one last year again I haven't carried that one either but isn't she adorable yes throw her up like this and you got on your your denim jacket Saturday afternoon running errands <laughs> on my feet oh the pants are just some old Ann Taylor crop, favorite crop pants you know I pull them out every season and I just have on my my favorite Cole Hunt tennis. They're the gold ones. I have them in black, white, and gold. I love these tennis ladies. If you don't want to get the big, thick sold ones, these are nice and comfortable. You can shop in them, can go out in them, you know. You can do a lot of things in them and you're comfortable yet stylish. So this is look number one, ladies. Simple, simple blazer from Talbot. It's fully lined, beautiful lining. Very nice. I mean, something that should be in your wardrobe because we all need a nice denim denim jacket. And I have tons of denim jackets, don't get me wrong, but this one is classy. This is, you know, along the lines of Ralph Lauren, classy. You know, only thing it doesn't have, doesn't have a pocket up here. But I guess they were going, they've got all the stitching here and I'm looking at it. I think it's adorable, adorable. And there's many ways that you could style this, but this, it's got stretch in it. It's a good jacket. And it would have been cool if I had, I, all the blazers I'm going to show you are in a size 6. But if I had gotten this maybe in an 8 to make it a little bigger, to wear over a sweater, you know. Even a 10 if I wanted that oversized look, you know, go for that. But you know me, I go for the classic fit. But I would love to try it. Next time I'm in the store, if they have it, I'm going to try an 8 on and see how it, how it feels on me to get this ladies you could do this we can do this we can be classic simple and pretty in this and oh this denim bag and you know coach is making a lot of denim purses right now but most of them are that light denim which is cool well, I like that but look at this in this dark denim <laughs> she is precious you know to find a dark denim bag and then to have it with this jacket who knew who knew? <laughs> so we're going to do the linen blazers next. And uh, I'll list all of these ladies, you know. I think Talbot still has them. And they have always got a sale going on. So you can catch up and, and grab these blazers. They're great for church. They're great for dinner dates. They're great for any function you have to go to and you need a blazer in the summer. Even though it's hot, you need a jacket sometimes. Look, pulled together and polished and finished. Your fashion, your style, your choice, and your age. I'll be right back. Now, let's keep, in keeping with the classic navy blue, 
this is a just a linen navy blue blazer again a size six i love the length of it and it's like a, a nubby kind of silk it has a little texture to it little you know how little slubs in and how silk will have sometimes and it's it's this six is cut loose and feels good it's comfortable it's lightweight so lightweight it's lined nice striped lining there wait let me get my clothes together <laughs> i can see a wrinkle there okay a crease there in the uh, undergarments but again you can wear it open you can wear it like this i mean just simple i have on just a old i think this is the ann taylor orange reddish orange see, I'm, I'm trying to match it matches my lips you get see where i'm going it matches my lips and my favorite favorite ralph lauren look at this little bag it's got the ralph back there but it's got all that embroidery beautiful embroidery and it's just like a little saddle bag i've had this probably almost three years now and Ralph should do some more. I love it. Anyway, on my feet, I just put on my white loafers to pick up the white little top underneath. It's just a little short sleeve uh, top and front banana. But the shoes, comfortable, little white loafers. And some of you bought these white loafers. Hey, a white loafer is a thing to have, especially this time of the year. I kept the necklace on. I kept the earrings on. We're trying to show up just... The blazers this week, right? But this one, you know, I could put a belt on the outside. It's loose enough for that. It's really cut. Where that denim one was really cut, really shaped, I almost could have gotten that in a one size up. I probably should have. If it goes on sale again, you know I might do it. <laughs> get it marked way down and get me a size 8 to wear, you know, when it gets cooler to wear a heavier uh, top under it. But I digress. We're talking about this one soft easy nice peak lapels just but you know just comfortable comfortable and you know me i can belt this with a wide belt a skinny belt it would look fantastic and what would you do with it and you can take this put it with a white skirt put it with a floral print put it over a a, a full dress even it's just so much you can do with this classic linen blazer so i added a little color <laughs> now next we're going to go with uh i'm going to do the, the purple stick around for the purple one and stick around for the end you're going to love that just hang out to the end that last finale you're going to love it of course you will anyway ladies this is it on the navy blue blazer from talbot's really nice oh i had unbuttoned it to show you that you can I forgot I had done that the other day. Take, you can unbutton the buttons. Sometimes you can't, you know, but if you can un unbutton, because it's a casual look, you can unbutton it and push that back like that, you know, or leave it buttoned. It's, it's a really, the linen they picked for this is really great. It's just so comfortable. You just feel like, you know, you're just comfortable, you're not restricted, you, you just you feel good. You feel classic, you feel simple. You feel pretty. <laughs> I'm acting silly, silly. Okay, next look coming right up. I'll be right back. A little lavender goes a long ways, ladies. A touch of purple, a touch of violet, a touch of color. And I like this color, I really do. I don't know that I would wear this color lipstick with it. I probably would do a more pinky berry color but this looks really good my camera stands doing something crazy here uh, well let me get right back to you one moment okay I ran out of space on my memory card so let's continue I don't even know where I was this is the lavender blazer how lovely is it is she not lovely 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 is exactly like the navy one I just had on with the single button, the same nubby uh, linen. This feels a little smoother. And just, you know, the pockets, nice pockets. It's got the lining, got the lining, got the lining. 
got the lining. And I just have on my Banana Republic black linen skirt. Of course, you know, something else. It's linen on linen. That's a great way to wear it, you know. My uh, white um, ink shoes. I thought I'd do the white and do the white bag since I got the black and white top. I was really, the only thing I could figure out that could, oh, I'm showing you the shoes and I'm running my mouth. These are the shoes, okay. The only thing I could really figure out to wear with this lavender would be white or black. But I would love to put it with a print. There's a Chico's dress that looks good in the magazine and online. I have to go in the store to see it. It has a lot of floral that I like. So I'm going to check that out. And it would probably go with that. I guess it would go with natural too if I had like the linen color. Linen. <laughs> linen color linen skirt it would go with that too but this works i mean you can always when in doubt add a little black to something right to keep it you know fresh looking too but i like it like this i added the black flower put the pearl choker on and just did the white for the accents to brighten it up but you know i'm i'm new with this color thing you know i i know how to mix neutrals and everything and how to put black stuff together. So I'm learning with the colors, ladies. I'm learning. This would look good with yellow, I think, too. I think I would like this with yellow and with a, a certain kind of pink. But it's a good, good color. Good color for you people that like purple. All right, finale's coming up. And it's going to be orange. It will be orange, and we'll see how you like that. And I want to appreciate I want to thank you and I appreciate you for sticking around and being with me each week. I love my time with you ladies. I really do. It's a wonderful time spent. And some of you have been sending me super thanks and I love that. You know, when you send me a super thanks and of course YouTube takes almost half of it. It's just ridiculous. You send me $9.99, I may get five or six dollars of that. YouTube gets the rest. I think it's just not right. It's just not right. But I appreciate the effort and the time. Just your views are enough to send me, you know, and I get the commercials run on, the ads that are run on my videos. I get paid by that. So if you just view it every week, give it a thumbs up and like it. And, and the more views, the better. And you don't have to come out of your pocket. Just a little bit of your time spent with me. And hey, that's priceless, right? That is priceless. So. We're going to get the new look. Remember to give this a thumbs up, a like, and subscribe, and tell your friends and share. You know, and oh, and I want to say thank you for all of you who said thank you and congratulated me on reaching 18,000. Yes, yes, yes. We're almost at 18,100 now. I think I'm like at 97 or something. I don't know. We'll get there, and we're going to get to the 900, get to the 19,000, and then, oh, I'll be <laughs> gritting my teeth to make it to 20. So, finale's coming up, ladies, and let's see if you like that color. So, this was, this was a touch of color for me, right? And I think I'm going to learn to play with this, because I kind of like it. I kind of like it. I kind of love it. I'll be back with the next, and the finale, just for you. Now this is how you do a finale, ladies. This is how you do a finale. Wow. This color says, yes, yes, yes. She is the best. Look at that. Look at that. I'm feeling this. I'm feeling this. Look at this orange of it all. The orange of it all. And Classy Kamara, you know you love orange. You need to get this jacket because orange is your favorite color. Look at this. Look, look, look at this. And I put it with uh, my old Ann Taylor crop pants. Love those pants. You know I do. And uh, Michael Kors. I have had this little orange bag for you know, almost three years now. Look at her with this. Look at her with this. She's perfect. She's perfect. She's so perfect. Perfection. And on my feet are just my cream color. They call it coconut cream. The uh, Vince Camuto pumps. Just a little classic pump with that kind of slanted heel in there with these. She's ready. She is ready. She is feeling herself. And this top, I have to show you this top I have on. 
It's from Banana. I just got it recently. It's got a nice square neck. Of course, you know, I'm trying to fill it up. With <laughs> it's got this nice square neck. Covered all the way in the back. Zips on the side. Right there, you know. Put it on. Stretch. Mine needs a little... I need to press that down. But it's a good little top, ladies. Get one. Get one to put in your wardrobe. It's an off-white. But this is all about the jackets, right? All about the jackets. Look at that. You know, I didn't think I liked these dark buttons on here at first. They're kind of a brown color. And this isn't linen. This is some, I don't know what you call this fabric. Yeah, I kept thinking it was not linen. It's some kind of cotton, but it's smooth. It's nice. And it doesn't button at all. It falls away. There are no buttonholes. It's just four buttons placed right here so it looks like it's double-breasted. So if you wanted to belt it, how cool would that be? But I kind of like the dark buttons on it now. They kind of accent. At first I kept thinking, why didn't they just put gold buttons? Or some white pearlized buttons, you know? But I kind of like this dark button. It pops on here. It really does pop. Wow. Now this color, my husband even likes this color. He said, now that's a good orange. So, he likes this color. I like this color. And I know you like this color. So, I don't know what other colors this jacket came in. But the comfort of it all is making me say, I need another one. I need one more. I wish it came in a red. I've been looking for a, I've been looking for a red linen blazer. I would love a red summer linen blazer. And I haven't found any. Everything is every fabric but linen. But wouldn't this be nice? This would be nice in red. This would be nice in navy. This would ooh, navy with the gold buttons. It'd be nice. I, it probably comes in white. I have a long white one from Talbot's from last year. But I like this. I like this is a longer cut, and you know longer cuts are more flattering to all sizes and all our figures. Now, if you're a little petite, you may not want to go long, but you can wear some of the jackets, you know, some of the long jackets. It's a way to wear it. You just have to get that, that right just a, just a position, whatever I'm trying to say here. But if not, you know, get the regular length. But, hey, all I want to do is hide those particulars back there. But I was loving the fact that it matched my orange back. You know, coordinated. I kept thinking, is it the same orange? But I think because of the tones, it works. You don't want to be matchy-matchy, but look at there. I broke the sandwich rule, huh? I got orange. I got... <laughs> I take. Sometimes it rules to be broken. So, ladies, that's it for this week. It was so much fun. Even though I ran out of memory on my memory card and had to go and dismantle the camera, put another card in, <sighs> reformat the, an old one to get done with this, but I, I just had to show you this. I had to finish. I had to finish, so you know what I got to do. I got to order me a, some uh, SD cards, but you don't care about that. This is it. Simple, classic, pretty, my fashion, my style, my age, and my choice. So ladies, I enjoyed this week. I enjoyed playing with color. We need a little color sometimes. We're gonna play with some more colors. Summer comes along, pull out some of those last year's fashions and see what I can do to, to bring them up to this year. You know, add something from this year to last year. We need to do a video on that. Last year's piece, this year's piece. Put it together and make a look because we all have those older pieces in our, in our closets, right? So. You know what I always say, leave a little kindness everywhere you go. Come back and see me because you know I'm here every Thursday. Every Thursday just for you, good Lord willing, and the Greek don't rise. <laughs> I love you all and thank you, thank you, thank you. Don't forget to, you know, if you want to splurge and get your Tom Ford, mm, mm, whatever you want to do, but it smells so wonderful. So I'll be back next week. I'll see you then and take care of yourself and be blessed so, thanks for watching Mwah. kisses to you bye bye